it on the side, you take the column out, you can't bend, so what you get is another arch over the column, and that's actually over the missing column. Here there is a column, but in this model it's missing. You constrain it on these two sides, and you have an arch forming. Were this structure not constrained on the sides, it probably collapsed. Okay, then we did another uh, student project. We took a drone in Italy uh, in a student project. That was just a student project, but it was fun to do. And uh, then we flew around here. And what we were interesting, interested in here was this little tower. And, uh, but that's a point cloud, Hochheit okay, Wacken Castle. This tower ruin. What you can do, of course, is make a point cloud out of it, embed it into a structure, and compute the stresses. Or shall I say, possibly the strains. Stresses not, because uh, uh, stresses are strains times a uh, constant, material constant. Who knows what the hell that material constant there is, yeah? We don't know what are the real properties of the wall, <coughs> what is the internal structure of the wall. And so it's a guess. It gives you an idea of what's happening in the structure. And what's happening is, of course, you have higher stress concentrations here. You have stress concentrations here in these corners. You have low stresses up here. And these others are above the windows. You also have low stresses because you have arches forming. Now you can take this model and you can start wondering, uh, yeah, well, what if I do changes? You know, maybe these reinforcements, where can I put them? How do I add? Where should I add columns? Is this structure in danger of collapsing? And <clears throat> these are uh, questions that we're trying to address. I just would like to summarize a little bit my talk. Time is up. So practically, practically, I think we should talk to each other. That's it. You know, you got point clouds, I got applications. We should, you know, it's, you have a geometric representation here that might be useful for other applications than you might have seen so far. And on the other hand, maybe uh, I don't see things that uh, you could uh, tell me in the coffee break that you might find fascinating to look at. So I would be very happy to talk to you afterwards about the topic, and I just call it scam, embed, compute. All right, see you in the coffee break. Thank you.